All right, what is good? What is happening, everybody? It's your boy Primitive AK here. We're back with another video. This time, a quick little tutorial on how to get bullet penetration kills. Uh, now, for those that are curious, I actually do have the Forge Camel unlocked for my snipers. And one of the challenges for those snipers is to actually get 15 penetration kills with the Cat AMR sniper. Now, the Cat AMR sniper is a very high damage bolt action sniper rifle that uh, has quite a bit of some kick, has a long uh rechambering speed and on top of that it, it the, you gotta get bullet penetration kills now at first glance this seems pretty easy and to be a, quite frank with you it, it can be easy only if you make it easy so there is a certain way that you're gonna have to do this and i actually have some gameplay playing in the background that way you guys can do this uh once we once we do get to that but before we do that i want to actually show you guys the class setup that you're going to want to actually using because there is actually a specific class that you need to be using so first things first in terms of the class i prefer to use something like aim idle sway or maybe even aim down sight speed if you prefer uh those are just kind of my personal preferences we're going to be using a laser sight so that way we could have a little bit faster ads speed the barrel doesn't really matter too much but we're going to be going with the 34 barrel just because it has that extra range and bullet velocity with the weapon which certainly does help so that way you're not losing any type of damage however the main attribute that you want to be using on this class setup is actually going to be the uh high the uh, armor piercing rounds um they, you can also use the mono but i noticed i was getting more hit markers when using this you want to be using the armor piercing rounds because what this is going to do is this is going to dramatically boost up your bullet penetration and, and allow you to shoot through objects because that is essentially what you have to do here with this you have to get kills through objects or any type of barricades or barriers uh or anywhere where the enemy is behind cover we had a similar challenge like this back in um cold war and uh, we haven't really seen too many challenges since so you want to make sure that you're using the armor piercing rounds this is a must use uh so just get that <laughs> make sure you have this on because it will make your life a lot easier when using this one um the rest of the class doesn't really matter too much you can kind of use whatever you'd like on this one uh i would definitely throw on rechambering speed as well just to help you out with that now let's go ahead and talk about the gameplay because there is a bit of a play style that you're going to have to adjust to when doing this now once again the ideal spot to get this done is going to be in the war game mode war game mode is by far one of the best spots to get the camos in this game and also leveling up your weapons when you get to the second sector on the defending side if you have engineer and like I, I forgot to mention this in the class setup you do need to have the engineer vest on uh there is going to be a certain spot of the map where the tank is moving down the middle of the map and there is actually a piece of cover that you could stand behind and when you have engineer on you could actually highlight the tank and you need to aim at a specific area where the enemy is getting on the tank that will allow you to get headshots on anyone that's going inside of that tank because you have the engineer perk on from your vest and you can actually see them through the wall now you can't see the player through the wall but if you just know exactly where to aim uh, by watching my gameplay you can literally get a wall bang kill by sitting behind a piece of cover another option you could actually do is by hiding behind cover where you have like maybe a bit of a head glitch where you have an enemy in your sight you go crouch immediately so that way you shoot through the barricade and then you shoot through the enemy as well this is another great tactic that i've used a lot uh when going for my penetration kills and uh this will pretty much make the challenge a lot easier so just to recap once again you want to stand behind a certain piece of cover so that way you have engineer on you can see where the tank is through the wall when it's moving and aim a little bit above where the where the gunner would sit inside of the tank and that will allow you to get a free headshot it's a guaranteed headshot you're not going to get a hit marker as long as you're using that armor piercing round like i mentioned and that will certainly help you guys out in getting those uh penetration kills but anyways guys let me know what you guys think about this video let me know if this helped you guys out because i know it's only 15 kills so it's really not that long but it can be a bit of an annoyance if you're not doing it properly so hopefully this helped you guys out thank you guys again for all the love and support i'll catch you guys in the next video it's your boy primitive ak Sign it out. Peace out, fellas.